if you've been dealing with pressure at the base of your head, I want to show you what may be going on with a balloon. Now, for part of this demonstration, I am going to be showing you using three things. So, firstly, what the balloon means, the balloon is your brain. And your brain is going to be sitting at the base of your head here, and it's supported by a little vertebra at the top, which is called your atlas, aka your C1 vertebra. Now, the reason that this is important is because your atlas is going to support the weight of your head, but what it also does is it physically attaches onto the base of your brain in order to keep it buoyant. But the problem is, is in some people, is if you've ever had a head, neck, or whiplash kind of injury, and what it can do is it can cause that vertebra to misalign even a little bit. What it can do is it can change the way that it's going to be putting tension and protecting your brain stem at this area. And what it can start to do is it can actually create certain amounts of tension that you can feel up at the base of your head, as if something is being squeezed right through the back there. Now, this doesn't always show up on MRI reports, but nevertheless, you can still have all of the different symptoms associated with it. Headaches, migraines, vertigo, dizziness, or even neurological or other pain problems in other parts of your body that you may have never realized are actually connected with your upper neck. So, if this is the case, if you're having problems, issues with pain, pressure, squeezing at the base of your head, let me ask you, when's the last time that anybody has ever checked to see if your atlas is properly aligned? So what we'd like you to do, if you haven't, is we'd like you to go over and check out our website, which is atlashealth.com.au, where you can request for a complimentary consultation to find out if we may be able to help you out. My name is Dr. Jeffrey Hanna from Atlas Health Australia, where we believe in hope, healing, and well-being from above, down, inside, and out.